You are now tuned in. Let's go to the Queen of the Trap podcast. Class and session, bitches. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the Queen of the Trap podcast. I'm your host, This is episode, what, 14 now? 14, yeah. 14 now. Um, I'm going to try and not talk too much tonight. Um, I kind of didn't want to talk anyway. Um, there's just been a lot going on. Uh, I'll explain a little bit. Of things, I first I want to start out by saying that um, shit's been a little bit crazy. Um, I have n- my health has not very been very well. Um, I've been having a, these like pass outs. I think it's because I'm dehydrated and um, just a little stressed. Um, so I passed out the other day. Um, I got to like a a real like low, and there's just been a lot going on. So I got to like a low point. I ended up in the hospital. Um, I ended up like you know I'm, I wanted to give up DJing. I was crying. I was doing dumb shit. Um, it's just been a lot lately, but um. You know, it took, I was just explaining this to Matt outside before that, you know, it took a couple of things to make me realize, like, all right, you fucking up over here. Like, you fucking up. You got to change some things. And, um, you know, some people have also reached out to me saying that, you know, there's some things I need to change. And I'm working on it. I am definitely working on it. I want to make my image, you know, a hundred. Um, I want to be able to run my business correctly. I don't want to be focusing on the negative. I should be looking towards the positive because, you know, I built this all by myself. I built this on just being me, just doing what I thought was the right way to be doing things because like I have ADHD and that's something I want to talk about too. Um, I want to bring awareness to that and it has to incorporate music. So that's why I decided to talk today. Um, I did have this particular thing on my mind. Um, but you know, I wanted to give up and it took, I had a friend explain to me like, Yo, people have hated on you for so many years because you've been out here fucking killing it. You're doing things that, you know, people wish they could be doing and you stuck to your guns like your whole life. So you would be fucking stupid, stupid if you gave up on this shit now. Like people envy you and like, I guess it took him, it took him to tell me that to like realize I forgot, like, I forgot, like, I really have been doing this for so long. I've been doing it on my own for so long, and sometimes it's okay to ask for help. Sometimes it's okay to be wrong, you know, but you can't fuck people over, and, um, yeah. So, I want to just explain, like, I, I do have a learning disability, and I don't, and I don't talk about it a lot, um to the public because I don't see it as like a learning disability like in some ways yes it's been my downfall my whole life it really has but it's also been the biggest like influence like I've been able to get here where I am today because of having ADHD and sticking to my guns and you know blocking out what everybody else has said and just like doing me but like I'm I I need to it's okay to change and I'm trying to learn to change um I'm trying to better my ways um especially business wise and personal wise but like you know, I wanted to sell my shit the other day and, you know, my girlfriends told me, no, you cannot do that. It'll be the biggest regret of your life. And then I just had somebody call me before, which I'm going to explain after. But I wanted to, uh, I had somebody call me before and tell me the same exact thing. That's what I was just trying to get at. 
Um, sorry, I have a lot on my mind now. Um, but so when it comes to the ADHD, ADHD is a learn. And I don't, and I just want to come out and say, I don't blame everything on this ADHD, but I feel like people need to be aware and maybe a little bit more lenient to like letting them learn because I tell you, learning has been very hard for me growing up. I want to. I I can only take in what I actually understand, and if I don't like the way it's done, sometimes I don't listen. But I'm trying to break those habits. So that's what I'm trying to say. ADHD is a mental disorder in children and adults. Okay, and. It causes them to move around more frequently. It causes them to be very impulsive. Um, Their behaviors are a problem growing up. And I've had all those issues growing up. I've literally had all those issues growing up. And I did so much better. Like, I went... I. When I was in school, like, I understood health more because that was something I actually wanted to learn. And that's why I was a nursing assistant for six years of my life. And, you know, I was an A student in college because I was learning on my own time. I actually, shout out to SUNY Empire State um, CDL program because they've been allowing me to get my radiology degree on my own time since 2014. And I was just explaining that before on the phone with my friend, which I'm still going to get to, um, that I would be stupid if I don't finish that because even if music doesn't work out, I have something to fall back on. But um, I also wanted to say, like, when it comes to the ADHD, if you don't understand what it is and you're not one of those people like to go and research because like you don't give a fuck, um, check out Joyner Lucas. Now that's why I brought this up. Check out Joyner Lucas's album called ADHD from start to finish. That album is my life story. If you don't understand me, go listen to that album. Because I tell you, it is me to the T. And that's why, like, I still have, like, I don't, that's why I didn't even give up. Like, I thought about, like, yo, look how far Joyner, like, and there's so many people with ADHD. So many people with ADHD in this world. But look at all the successful people who have got through what I've gotten through. Um, Joyner Lucas being one of those people. And he was the first person to actually express it to the public in music and what we got going on. And that's why, like, I'm talking about it today because it has to relate to music. If you don't understand, go listen to that and then, like, come back to me and yeah but it's been a lot lately I'm not giving up I am rambling about this a little bit because I had a lot on my mind with it um but I'm just trying to do better I'm really not happy right now but uh the show must still go on it's business um this is my business I'm a businesswoman first uh my life consists of making money 24 7 and that's why we do this and like I thank you all who support, who contribute, who believe in me. Um, I just thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, I'm just, at this point, I'm trying to keep calm, trust God, and stay focused. Um, I want everybody to, if you are an artist right now and you're tuned in, send us your tracks. Matt, you can put it back up. Um, The $5 cash app is right there. Uh, I'm just trying to, you know, finish my sentences and speak calm. We were just talking about 80. We were, we lit, yes. (laughs) We literally were just talking about how we're trying to change bad habits. One of my things is I ramble a lot and just speak my fucking mind. And I'm trying, I'm really trying to talk calm today and 
and just take everything one step at a time. You know who else is calm today? Hashtag Lil Squid. The Squid. <laughs> the the squid. squid. So, okay, so <laughs> I don't know where Matt pulled this out of, but um, we named it. I named it Little Squid. I bought it at 7-Eleven. It said, I seen on TikTok. And so was it TikTok? Yeah, everyone was like, look, on TikTok, reversible squid. If you put him on the green side, he's got a sad face. Oh. But that side's pink. And well, getting back to this show, Mister. So if you're tuning into the Instagram live right now, you're not seeing shit today. And the reason why you're not seeing shit is because, um, the well, number one, Matt starts the show a little bit before um we actually go live on in uh, Facebook, and I uh, had some complaints and um. And I was like, we absolutely have to change that because this show is for the viewers. So um, shout out to, you know, who who let me know that because thank you for that. I needed to hear a third party tell me that <laughs> the Instagram is just not cool. But Matt has been saying this since the show started. We need to be redirecting everybody to the Facebook. So if you are on the Instagram Live, you are seeing a big black little post that um, and the the screen is black and it's telling you to watch the Facebook so for now on I'm going to start doing that um I know a lot of you hate Facebook but it's you could literally just type in facebook.com queen of the trap you don't even have to go on your own Facebook account to watch the show um but definitely go support go like go share support us um follow the page um, YouTube as well, Mixcloud, it's all at the bottom of the, oh, this side of the screen. Anyway, another thing I wanted to talk about, so I know I've been sleeping on these trap juices, man, I know, and but it's summertime now, it is summertime, and, uh, we are almost a week or two away from launching them, as long as we could get the... I mean, we pretty much have everything else. I literally dropped off the boxes of material to Matt today. Um, I've had them sitting at the house for a while. Um, these would be the sizes. These are the sizes that we're going to be starting out with. Now, everybody's been asking me, what are these trap juices? It's obviously alcohol. It's alcohol. Um, somebody asked me if it was like a weed product. I was like, no, but, but we can get into that later. Um, cause there's ideas for that too, but Matt, so a little bit of a setback has been, um, the labels. So these are the labels that I originally had made, but as you can see, well, if you can see it, um, my old Instagram account is on that label, so we can't use those anymore, but Matt designed, oh, this is the first time we're showing the label. Hold on. Are we allowed to be doing this right now? Yeah, I'll see why not. Okay, so I haven't showed the new labels this yet. This isn't the official label. This is just the test print of the label. It's going to change again, probably, but this is, this is pretty much what it's going to look like. Matt's been working hard, like, because my labels, I literally just print it up at home. The design has gone through a few different stages. It's, but, so, when we designed this, I absolutely wanted the trap house, because, like, you know, the trap. Um... Another thing was, I wanted 2 chains' trap house in the background, but the way it came out on the print, um, it just wasn't going to work. But, so, the reason why, I had this, I had this, like, uh, vision in my mind for trap juice. I need a styrofoam cup. Like, I, like, have you, if you've seen any of the mixtapes that Gucci Man has done, or cheesy or I think how I I really thought about it was um shout out to DJ Unique DJ Unique um his purple drank cover so that's what made me think of doing this so now you are officially going to see the new queen of the trap labels we're not doing the glitter on it but it look, still looks cool this is what it's going to look like here we go and it's got my little styrofoam cup on it um we have menus made up i have put it on instagram i have put the menus on instagram but we didn't tell you what the drinks were actually going to be 
we're going to announce that as soon as the labels come back. Because then all me and Matt have to do is go shopping. That's it. Um, so that's that. Wednesday, um, Tone Island. Shout out to DJ Tone. Shout out to DJ Tone. I gotta say, like, I mean, I tell this story all the time. I Tone was just some kid who would sit next to DJ Danja uh, at Nappers, and I would always be the drunk idiot. Like, if you're not as good as him, I will never respect you as a DJ. And this kid blew my fucking mind. Like, he's younger than me, and he's killing it on Long Island. And he was actually, shout out to him, because he's like the first person on Long Island to give me a chance to do gigs. So shout out to you. And what I wanted to say as well was shout out to you for being the first person to put me on an official flyer. That's like something... That's something I'll never forget. Thank you, DJ Tone. And, you know, he's, he's done an interview on the Queen of the Trap podcast before. I always support everything. He has a new track out right now, King of Long Island. Go listen to it. Um, YouTube, YouTube, Apple Music. Mix, we played it, like, last week. Um, so we're doing a sh- an event again on Wednesday. It's from 4 o'clock to 10 o'clock. I don't have the location right now. It's going to be me, DJ Bear, um, Stitch, 631, and, you know, DJ Tone. So definitely come down, come support. Um, Contact DJ Tone if you want the location. It's free. Um, I told Matt he should probably pull up too. Matt pulled up to the last one. Actually, I don't even think we got to talk about last time that show was awesome but you all uh, bruised my ass you all bruised my ass oh my god yeah we haven't had an episode since then so that was the show that i got a text message saying that i killed it i killed the last show and i was like oh i hope i did but i was the entertainment mostly and that's 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 another thing like i built i built this Off of just being me. Everybody found me so entertaining because, like, I was just always the party animal. I was the bad girl. All that shit. And I built, like, car jams with Carrie, and then car jams with Carrie led to the queen of the trap, and then queen of the trap led to everything else. So, like, it's all about evolving and trusting your process and stuff like that. But, so... I've been learning. I've been showing up to DJ Tone's events. He's been giving me a chance. Um, Matt's going to be selling the trap juices soon at these events once we get them out. Sorry, I'm trying to change out my jewel cartridge. Um, if I, I'm, yo, with these fucking jewel pods, man, that green cap, <laughs> complain every to, single hold week, on. I find a new one. Complain <laughs> to me because everybody's either complaining about my jewel pods or my fingernails because I'm a weirdo. So I used to work in the hospitals and you couldn't wear nails. I got so used to gluing on yeah, ladies, you don't need to go get your nails done. Go to CVS and get you a $7 pair of nice nails because, girl, they still look fire. Uh, well, <laughs> girls. Should I be looking for nails instead of just jewel pods? I'm Do you know how many people have complained to me? I know you've been in this person's car because your fingernails are on the floor. That is disgusting. But, like, hey, that's me. I still look cute and I'm, I'm ratchet. I don't know. I'm just DJ K Dev. Love it or hate it. (laughs) I don't know. (laughs) Anyway, um, I don't really even want to talk about this part yet, but my birthday is next Wednesday. Happy birthday to me. So next Monday, I will not be doing a show. Um, but next Tuesday, I will be doing an interview with Moo Moo. Everybody go follow her. She, I tell you, her voice is the cute. You think my voice is cute? Her fucking voice. She sounds like a little mouse. I like love. <laughs> I love the shit. No, like I love. Hold on. I have drops by her. I might play one. But she has the cutest voice. You're going to love her. She actually, her, her singing is beautiful. Her singing is beautiful. And she dances. Go check out her Instagram. She'd be shaking it. Um, I see you, girl. So definitely go check that out. And it's going to be June 13th. Um, 
Let's see. What else did I... Oh, I really don't have anything else to talk about. <laughs> I didn't want to talk that much today, so I apologize. But You're 20 minutes in. Wow. That's when not... you talk, the show just flies, man. I love it. Really? See, I think I just like I'm a motor mouth. Ma- was that too loud? Sorry. I, I'm, I'm a motor mouth, and I feel like people don't want to hear me half the time. But I'm glad that. Well, isn't it your show, your microphone, your chair? You true. You want for as long as you want. Since it's I mean, I you. have to promote all the things mm-hmm. that I'm doing and what's going. Like w- we have been sleeping on these trap juices for a little while. We really have. So we have to keep promoting it because when it comes out, it's going to be fire. It's going to be fire. Um, you know, I, I had to alert the world that, like, yes, people with ADHD <laughs> cut them a little bit of slack because we are really trying. And some of the most successful people have ADHD, so don't give up on us, period. <laughs> anyway, we have a lot of music today, guys. We have a lot of music. We do. Um... I don't even know who to... Okay, so I'm actually going to start from the top because I know that these said people were, like, the last people to message me and say that they sent in music. Um, So, Johnny Floss. Shout out to Johnny Floss and DJ Chase. Shout out to them. They always support the Queen of the Chap podcast. So, definitely, definitely go check them out. And this is called... To the top T to the top TFA to the top TFA. All right, give me one second because I don't know. Here we go. They make you pay. to take this ride with me real quick yeah we heading to the top now yeah the hustle don't stop now yeah we gotta keep on going yeah baby we just keep on going yeah see the hustle don't stop even when i want to sleep i need that money off the back end yeah grinding when i want to eat you see the muscle gone pop and i'll be in a white tee so put your money where your mouth is, yeah Let the Benjamin speak Yeah, it's the king, baby How you feeling? I'm living dreams, baby How you living? I got William on the phone Trying to get it dialed in Conference calls with the team Cause the team about the biz Say I got her old soul Let me teach these kids Ain't nothing worth the life you live Except the life you give Manifest the one day at a time You gotta stay on your grind You gotta stay on the line You gotta stick to the process When it seem like a hot mess Calm the flow, yeah Let it speak to your conscience Yeah, yeah Let it speak to your conscience You can send it on my way Yeah, we're heading to the top now, yeah The hustle don't stop now, yeah we Gotta keep on going, yeah Baby, we just keep on going, yeah See, the hustle don't stop Even when I wanna sleep I need that money off the back end, yeah Grinding when I wanna eat You see, the muscle gon' pop And I'll be in a white tee so put your money where your mouth is, yeah. uh-huh. let the Benjamin speak. Uh-huh, yo, now it's a movie every time me and Paula link up, headed to the top, cause the only direction is up, head after head, it don't matter what we touch from, Old Town to BK and back up, dynamic duo, anytime that we flex, only time we beef is when the Cavaliers play the Nets, the grind gon' pay off, expect nothing less, yeah we do it for the love, but we don't mind all the checks. We popping bottles, no more waiting at the bar. Went from cheap soup to eating crackers with caviar. I'm not going lie, it's part of the elevation. Cause it don't taste good, but it's good for conversation. We know greatness, don't leave us out the topic. And I got my white tee, three chains on top of it. Grown man, not a minor. Signing off Johnny Floss, aka Mr. Clever. Yeah, One minus no the joke. Top now, yeah. The hustle don't stop now. Even when I wanna sleep, 
I need that money off the back end, yeah. Grind it when I wanna eat. When I wanna eat, yeah. yeah. That was King Pot. So I didn't say that before, and I apologize because it. I don't know what's going on, but it's making me now download the tracks and play them on Apple Music. So. It's King Paula featuring Johnny Floss. Shout out to them. Shout out to Johnny Floss. That track was fire, boy. Shout out to <laughs> DJ Chase because DJ Chase is his DJ and who discovered Johnny Floss. And um, Johnny Floss, he even said it at the end, he's always got the clever one-liners. He always has them. He is he and Matt was like, what did, wait, what did you just say about um the track? Like how did you feel about it? Straight up to me, it just sounds like some bone thugs and harmony shit. And, and the I track just was fire. I literally just said he's from Brooklyn, so like he's real New that's York. Straight from everybody goes right everybody spot. needs to go support him. That's, that's my type of hip hop. I know man. that's Very, deep, deep bad, man. With this See? Trap music, that is just fire music, but that track but, got me hyped just now. Maybe we'll play it back at the end. Yeah, Music again. is universal. Everybody's going to adapt to it one way or another. Um, okay, so a shout out to Maria Williams, the management of the Rich Hoochies. Um, I actually did an interview with them. At, their name was a different name. Uh, now that's not their name. It is the Rich Hoochies. Um, so I think we're going to be setting up a new interview soon. But this is called Save Them. Let's hear it. I think we've played this on the show before. Sit so sit, Okay, cut it. Oh, uh, that was Rich Hoochie 
Ladies, and shout out to their management, Maria Williams. So Matt just reminded me of something. Matt just reminded me of something. Um, I have a track now. I just tried to... I tried to get him to come back in the live or at least message me. I don't know if he's watching on Facebook right now, but I wanted to know if I had permission to play this DJ New Era song by Big D because it's fire. Um, and oh, my God, the air conditioning just turned I on. just felt that. Um, I thought it was a ghost or something. <laughs> No, the ghost is in Pac-Man's All right, let's not even talk about that right now. We got music playing. You know what? Um, I, I don't know if I have permission, but I got it right here. So here it is. This is this is New Era, and I believe it might be dropping on Monday. I don't know. But it's fire. This is that real niggas. No cap. New era, this is that new era, this is that new era, this a fact, get money, don't hate, do better, this is that new era, this is that new era, this is that real niggas, no cap, new Yo. era. Shit, fit a cap low, show you lame niggas how the shit go. Real trap niggas, so elbows, know some essays with them kilos. Got to the top from ground zero, eating beats up like a bistro. Kinda let me out that cage, nigga. I'm killing shit back in beast mode. Never been a rat, kept it G, bro. About to put the game in a sleep hole. You niggas hatin', I want all the smoke. Big D the man, nigga, case closed. You capped up, I'm strapped up. Hollywood niggas wanna act up. Till I pull up, ski masked up, and get mad, thing they ask for. I'm running shit, no track team. Used to weigh it up on a trip. Beam. Hit the next tail, tell me what you need Had to bleed the block, fuck a hoop dream Fuck a hundred K, I want real green We undefeated like the dream team New era, Cali and Big D Drop heat like Miami, Big 3 Nigga, we the best, motherfuck the rest Been through it all, we passed the test We grind hard, God kept us blessed We want a million, nigga, nothing less You can keep the fame, we want the checks Fuck the hoes too, don't need the stress Ain't no question, we got next And we putting all the hate niggas to rest This is that, real niggas, no cap New era, this is that, new era this is that new era. This a fact. Get money. Don't hate. Do better. This is that new era. This is that new era. This is that real niggas. No cap. New era. This is that new era. This is that new era. This a fact. Get money. Don't hate. Do better. This is that new era. This is that new era. This is it's that game time. I'm a seasoned vet. Rock town hustler. That's what I rep. Big labels calling. Tell them write a check. I'm take half a meal to get me out the bed. You heard. Right, that's what I said. I'm cocky with it. Got the big head, talking blue hunters, that real bread. Like all my presidents, old and dead. I'm taking off, don't need a jet. Can't name a beat, I didn't fucking rent. Came from the trap, earn my respect. A lot of niggas foul, so I keep a tent. Won't hesitate to leave a nigga wet. I'm the best secret, little rock kept. Rep Arkansas to the day I'm dead. Probably go to jail for secrets in my head. Underground king like Bun B. Trill to the heart like Pimp C. I rep for all them real niggas like Dope B and Mo 3. Stay strapped up at all times. Can't let a fuck nigga hold. Me. I'm on court, ballin' hard, nigga, y'all way up in the nosebleed This a new era, real niggas only I do this shit for my dead homies Cut some niggas off, them boys phonies Wanna be me, but you can't call me Time to pay the bookie, I'm coming hard for any nigga that ever owed me It's clutch time, game on the line I want the last shot like that nigga Kobe This is that, real niggas, no cap, new era This is that, new era, this is that, new era This a fact, get money, don't hate, do better This is that, new era So that was Big D. Big D is actually in the Instagram right now. Um, we hey, up, we were we were talking to him while listening to his track. Uh, you guys couldn't hear us, but he can hear us. And um, you know, New Era said he should put that out as a single, and I just agreed that like he really really should put that out as a single. That song is dope. 
Um, I definitely want to put it on a mix. And I also said Arkansas has a fire sound. Like, they just fire. And what you just said, um, to fill in, I don't, it's just how people, like, it's how people talk. It's. It, it just goes... It's just like there's so many songs. That I mean, so listen, good. I I'm I'm like, not from the south, but when it comes to like the Queen of the Trap stuff, I listen to me and like you know I some people get offended by it, but I tr- I've that's something I've changed over the process of many years now. Is that when I'm rapping somebody else's song, you you'll catch me maybe mouthing that word. And I don't mean to, I don't mean to offend anybody. It's just like you learn your thought process. It's just, it's natural because you've been listening to that for so long. So when you're putting out your own music and that's how you normally talk or that's how you would normally spit on a track, like that's what you're going to portray in your music because you're going to keep it authentic. And, you know, you're not, it's like, this is how I put it. Clean versions versus dirty versions. And I realized that the other day. I fucking hate clean versions to music. Yeah, but it's no, I hate it. I'd rather hear the ratchetness. It's like, that's like listening, that's like listening to a mixtape without any drops. No, but just listening to straight songs. It's so boring. Yeah, it's not about, it's not, it's, it just, it's just lyrical laziness. It's just like, Hold just on. feeling He said, words, you know? that's just me. I use that Bernie Mac uses that mother uh mo wait hold on i, I can't read because this this background on the comment uh, it's not me like stuttering right now like i can't see the uh comments because of the background um that's just me i just use that like bernie mac uses the word motherfucker lol no it's not it's not we got gem alexander in the building Alexander. You could fit so many words in there that would rhyme with flow. Gem, I just asked. Uh, I could say this out loud because he knows I'm friends with his brother like that. I asked your brother to be my uh, date to my ten year reunion. So I think if he can, if he can come out, it'll, it's party time, and obviously you're gonna pregame with us. So you know. Uh, Shout out to Jam, everybody. Yo, and I was like, wait, I was actually talking about him the other day too. I was like, yo, his numbers, like he's really, he's really doing well for himself. Like I'm so proud of. Uh, oh, I just called. Oh, his name is Alex. Okay, but I'm proud of Jam. I'm proud of Jam. Um. He's he really is killing it. Shout out to the whole oh, Shout out to the whole Hollywood family. family. That's my family. I still call Jem, Jem Alex my sister's boyfriend because like my sister's obsessed with you. My sister is literally obsessed with you. Um all right, back to the music guys. Back to the music. We have a lot of music. Um hold on one second. So, um Diana Okay, wait, hold on. So their Instagram is Instagram name is Diana Drill. So go follow her, Diana Drill. Um, she did send in uh and contribute the five dollar. Actually, I think she sent a little bit more than that. And we appreciate that. Thank you very much. Um oh, and see, I was just talking about this. She's got a dirty version and a clean version. And also, oh, wrong side. If you're watching the Facebook right now, um, $5 submission right there. And then um, the email is in my bio. Send me your music. I will play it. Um, I might even use it as DJing material. A lot of people who sent in to me, uh, they've been on mixtapes now. And I I push their music every, every time I do an event. I was actually Milk Cheesy. That just reminded me, Milk Cheesy, I'm going to play Nike Calling because um, we were talking about that today. But let's get to this. Um, Working On Me is the song. Let's hear it. Shout out to DJ Bear. I'll see you Wednesday. It's playing. There's I want to progress. progress. I don't need dickheads ringing my phone. This I don't video. want no sex. No sex. I want to make dough. Yeah. I wanna lay low. Yeah. I wanna do what I wanna do whenever I say so. I don't fuck with my ex no more. Nah 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 nah. No. He ain't making me vex no more. Nah 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 nah. No. 
No time for the comments from haters. I'm here for the money. money. You're hating, then I'll see you later. Don't stare at me funny. Just to stay true to the team, and you know this. The flow that we bring is the coldest. Can somebody tell me the latest? Cause you mind assigning the oldest. Me and the man, them are bossing. Best life that we're living. We can't be taking the losses. You know that we're winning. Winning. Everyone's staring at us. Cause we about to tear this shit up. Now we're not giving a fuck. So tell me, just tell me what's up. I'm trying to make something from nothing. Yeah. But you bitches only want one thing from me. From me. Right now I'm working on me. On me. Look at these nitties that be looking on me. Right now I'm working on me. On me. Look at these nitties that be looking on me. pretty dope and I gotta talk about it. I just told Matt Diana Drill go follow her that video was very very different oh oh no oh no but I'm still on I'm turn still turn around and plug the fucking orange cord into the wall shit it wasn't plugged in wow how did that happen are we still live yeah the microphone's still Oh my God, guys, I don't know what just happened. Anyway, sorry for the technical. See, this show is very dysfunctional. There's always today. something. Okay, so. Go, just started beeping. What the fuck is Where's. Going is it working on the live? Yeah, it'll give it a second. Okay, back. so I want to say. Can we go a little overtime today? Because I feel like we've been a little bit slow. We got some music. No, but all right, let's try and get through this stuff. Okay, so Diana Drill, she sent me her YouTube video to that. Your, I just told Matt to come around and, like, kind of peep your uh, your YouTube video. And I have to say that was very different. And why I say that's different, because I was, me and Matt literally oh, said... Yeah. We can relate to that track. All your words that you said, we could totally relate to that. The image, now you're not seeing this, but I am. She's like in pigtails with a gas mask and a fur coat in a nice ass. Like it looks like a, a castle you would see in London. Like it's with beautiful paintings in the background, poker chips. It. This is this is art. This is art. And that was fire. So I don't even think we've been doing this microphone thing, but that's something I would totally give a five because, like, that package was well put together. The whole package of that. And it was different and relatable. So that's Can you give what that a five? I'm going to give that a five. Is Mac going to start doing the... Okay, so what else we have? Yeah, you love your gunshots. Huh? Oh, so I have to switch. So I have to switch emails real quick because we because I don't know what happened with my email today. But Sean, still I want to say, um, every track he's been sending, I've been playing. It's been fire. His I don't know if he's managing these people, but he keeps sending in these. Um, TTS Tanner, whoever TTS Tanner is. This man is fire. Go follow him. Every track. And I want to hear these two tracks that he sent in. So let's hear it. This one is called Jeffrey... Jeffy Gordy? Jeffy Gordy... I think it's Road. Jeffy Gordy Road. Okay. Sorry. I'm trying to just, like, read it through the emails, guys. And here it is. Hey. 
Hey, I'm lit as a bitch. Split a couple bins up on the fit. Give me mad that I'm throwing the fit. Leaving bullet holes up in your fit. I ain't stop feeling till I hit click. Here you with whoever you with. Go and get them whoever you get. Thought it came in that nigga a bitch, bitch, click. Boom, big goon. Rugo, I see a big gangway. That's around the town, we laying them down. To the G's, no, he don't play big. I be backing them down with the knee, no pound. Leaving them right on the pavement. They had told him to breathe, I think it's too late. And really say he won't make it. Stop faking. And just call me Jason. I be getting so tired of these niggas from none of that CJ and make them a patient. We be getting on racks, don't know how to act. We in a spot that's vacant. Say you moving with shooters, I'm moving with Uders. All of my niggas are sanctioned. Okay, okay. Shooters coming out from both ways. Close range, but they know that we got aim. Got game. Light them up, let the god bang. You a lame. Living lies, you should be ashamed. I cannot trust no nigga, love no bitch. You know I mean that shit. What? Huh? How can I, how can I trust no nigga, let no bitch, you know I mean that shit How can I, what, law, go How can I trust no nigga, let no bitch, you know I mean that shit I just move and need to try to creep, I let that heater spit Bitch, I'm too early and I don't got time for no politics And I hate these bitches choosing, so I'm moving with a stick All his ass did him dirty, fuck it, we ain't showing mercy Hook a driver, he gets sturdy, no check, Jeffy Goldy Alphabet boys, we know me Lying nigga, rats you call me Bitch, niggas, did they call me God, God damn Oh, that was TTS Tanner Jeffy Gordy Now, I gotta, like I said I gotta tell you They've been sending fire. And I I really, like, in the beginning of this new genre, era, whatever you want to call it, of music, I was not fucking with the new trap. I was not fucking with the new hip-hop. Like, I used to tell my ex Davies wasn't shit. Now look at me. I'm, like, promoting Davies out the asshole because, like, he's phenomenal. Like... Music changes over time. And actually, I think me and Rich Stars, I was up in Rich Stars' live the other day and we were having that talk. Music changes every five years, but it also, it not every five years, it changes all the time. People, people are putting out different sounds all the time. But long story short, what I'm trying to say is I... I started fucking with drill more. And now I'm like, I fucking love, the, I love when they send in music. I really do. And shout out to TTS Tanner. Shout out to Sean Still. Um, so we have another one by them. And it's TTS Tanner featuring Slice GZ. And it's called Money and Violence. Ooh. Ooh. Money and Violence. Let's hear it. Okay, come get with me, they know who run the city 
boys get busy. Forever pretty and easy. Dog ain't die with his glizzy. The fuck that nigga said. featuring Slice GZ. Now I've heard the TT Squad before. That just made me curious because like I've heard that before. Are you guys like on a team? Maybe I have to do my research. I, I've heard it before. Um. Anyway, the next one I want to play, and you've definitely heard it before, uh, but it's one of my favorite tracks. It's also on one of my mixtapes. I think it's Mixtape number four on my mix cloud. Um, this is Milk Jeezy Nike Calling. He is also a part of Fit a Cap Low. Check it out. Here it is. Jeezy! I mean, who that is calling, man? Fuck your producer, my features by me. Off. I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. I took them off. I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. All of these checks, cause I'm chasing these millions. Say to myself, I don't do the Swear that they real, but don't really feel them. Pick up the hate, I just pray that he heal them. Fake motherfuckers, just pray he reveal them. Yeah, the ones trying to tear down what I'm building. Stacking my chest till I get to the millions. Then I say that I'ma sit on them billions. Big fat, big racks, nigga. Thought I had a contract, didn't you? Ice game, wet, wet, baby. Thought I had plenty of them fishes. Smooth lane, whip, game, rain. Everything we sliding, riding inches. Falling like blast, so baby, these bucks make a bitch pay attention. Phone jumping off the hook, huh? Calls back to back, whoa, hey, like it's this milk, GZ. Yeah, man, I asked who wants to know first. Yeah, it's John down the hole. And I heard you've been running up to check. Yeah, and I reviewed your resume. And I like to bring you on deck. Here's a check. I took them off. I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. I took them off. I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. I took them off and took them up top. I did it because they be capping a lot. What I say on the beat, I really didn't did or really I'm doing. I had it a guy. Check out the check, yeah, I'm running it up. The play on this level, a hundred and up. That three on the one got me bubbling up. I'm dishing it straight, ain't no cutting it up. I was sitting in prison and made a decision. Found me a plan, now I'm living my vision. Everything that I projected to be, I'm doing the did it, you gotta compete. Send a shot without looking, I'm stuck on the beat. I ain't gotta pretend, boy, I'm really a beast. Nike be calling when me go commercial, they say that I really be ballin' PG. Checks all around me, nigga, like Nike sponsored the kid. Conference call, why a nigga jiggin'? Say they really like the way I jig. Dib and dab all through the sea. Yeah, they know Milk G's that do it big. Hit the booty club to see some cheats. I just paid a couple bitches bills. I took them off, I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. I took them off, I did it again. These niggas be mad cause they know I'm a win. I ran up them bags and blew me a check. I got Nike calling like, what's up with that? What's up with what? You know what's up. Ballin' like blessed, so I play with them bucks. Straight out the south, so don't play with me, bruh. All of these checks, Nike calling me up. I know all the words. The man's like, I'm trying to learn all the words. No, I know all the words because I DJ it at every event. And I told Milk Jeezy that today, too. I was like, I'm going to be playing that again this Wednesday. Like I said, I have an event this Wednesday. Um, go follow DJ Tone Experience, uh, Tone Island Events. Um, it'll be this Wednesday from 4 to 10. You have to DM him for the location. 
So the last thing I wanted to talk about before um, we end the show tonight. So before we started the show, I got a phone call from my friend who is a DJ, Eric. Um, he DJs literally down the block from my house at one of my local bars. Um, he's phenomenal. I've known him for many years now. He also knows all my DJ friends. Um, so he reached out to me and we were talking about like the DJing stuff and... Um, he just gave me really good advice, but also I said to him, I was like, yo, if you have anything like you can't make and you need it, like, or, you know, if I could jump on any of your sets, like, let me know. And he was like, well, that's kind of why I was calling you. He was like, so I have a couple opportunities for you. I work every other weekend in the hospital. So do you want to do Celtic every other weekend? And I was like, yo, I literally am walking distance. Like I... That was the first bar, like, I ever, I think I ever went to. Um, shout out to Celtic Crow. That was the first bar I got kicked out of, too. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Before the Napper's days. Before the Napper's days. Yes, actually. Uh, not gonna lie there. Uh, but the past is the past. I am a, I am way beyond that stuff nowadays. But, um, so, Are yeah, you? I am. Um, I we won't even get into what happened. <laughs> Actually, that's the same situation that happened at Nappers. So yeah. we don't really have to. Everybody knows that story, so we don't have to get into it. But shout out to Eric for giving me this opportunity. So I guess DJ K Dev, DJ K Dev, Celtic Crossing, you can Kings Park. You can follow it on Instagram every other Saturday. Um, I'm not sure. I will let everybody know when the first Saturday will be. Um, I'm trying to work it out with him right now. But I did get that opportunity. I actually have to call him after this show again to touch base with him again. But thank you, Eric. Thank you for believing me. Yo, Eric is like one of my very good friends. I tell you, like I said, that was the first bar I ever went to. And probably the first DJ I won't. Well, yeah, probably the first DJ I annoyed, too. Um, play my music. I want ass-shaking music. That was me. Or I was, like, fucking pressing everybody's buttons. And now, look at me. Here I am today being my own DJ doing all of that. So we have two minutes left. Um, I just want to say thank you. Um, next week we are taking off from the Queen of the Chat podcast. Um, we will return July. Or no, maybe maybe we maybe we will be returning probably last last week of June. I don't know. We'll we'll let you guys know. But thank you for tuning in tonight to the Queen of the Trap Podcast. I'm your host, DJK Dev. That is Matt. Go follow him on Instagram too. And have a good night. <laughs> Oh,